Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of How to Project Flight. Okay, I know it's such a good name. You don't have to say it. Well, in today's video, you guys will be learning how you can push back and start up an aircraft and then taxi to the runway and take off and then finally land. So, most of you are probably new. So, let's start with some of the settings. You can use these settings if you're on a high-end device or you can use these settings if you're on a low-end device well since I'm on a high-end device I'm gonna choose these settings and now you can just X out of these settings and this is the main menu click on I now and you'll be shown this click on free flight and you come to this area on the right hand side you can see a bunch of aircraft choose one that you like personally if I was new at the game I would choose the Airbus A320 right here it's pretty easy to handle so I'll yeah, just click on that and when the plane loads uh, then just click on this confirm button down here now you can pick your livery which is kind of the skin of the aircraft i guess you can choose your favorite airline or you can just keep it blank i'll just go with normal airbus right here and then just click confirm and choose your airport i would go with gatwick okay so just click on that go con click on confirm and just choose any random gate if you're new go for 201 or uh, or 204 okay because they both have like the easiest routes i guess to taxi to the runway now just click confirm down here okay now you should be in your plane it might take you a while it depends on your device okay so this is your plane right here are uh, the controls this is the autopilot this is the pushback these are just you know this helps you to navigate to a different airport now let's start by pushing back onto this line right here this one right here now the controls for a uh, laptop or pc and mobile they both will be different but mostly everything is the same so if your game's lagging please just head on over to this options on the top okay go to these settings right here and turn off trees okay and if you would like you can get rid of your call sign up here and the airport names it's, it's not so i'm just gonna keep the trees because i love oxygen you can either click here on the pushback or you can just press p okay, and this should change to push right here now your plane will start moving back press a okay and now you can kind of like control it all right now b is for brakes okay on pc so you can use b if you're going too fast Press A and if when you control, when you move your mouse, your aircraft goes in kind of like the opposite direction, I guess. So yeah, this can take some time to master. So you should just be right here somewhere, okay? Just like press P again whenever you want to stop taxiing, okay? And just hold B, okay? When you hold B, your brakes get activated and you know, you just like start to slow down and voila you have back i guess yes now on the side you'll see these two things engines okay you wanna click on this right here and then wait or what you can do is push e and uh yeah it might be different depending on the aircraft but usually one engine starts up first and then the other one but if you wanna like quickly take off then just you know just click on both of those okay now this is a quick you know trick i guess that i learned what you can do is just click here on the autopilot now there's the speed thing so you just dial this up to i don't know let's put uh eight okay yeah let's put this to eight click set and uh, yeah this will automatically you know just the thrust and uh, now you just want to kind of keep the nose of your aircraft almost on the line try to okay i'm just gonna if you want to change the time of the day and if it's like not comfortable for you to land at night just click here and then just adjust i'm gonna keep it day so that you all can see clearly when you're taxiing uh, you might wanna you know set your flaps if you, if you want to do a realistic role play you can set your flaps it doesn't really matter it doesn't really help. i think that's what i know just kind of slowly move turn and uh, i'll meet you guys when i'm right there on the runway right guys so i just sped up my aircraft because you know it takes time to taxi but yeah 
here i am okay i'm about to enter on the runway okay um what you want to keep in mind is that you want to set your speed a bit less because you don't want to go on the grass if you do it's completely okay uh, if you want to be realistic you really need to follow these and if you're going too fast you can always just push b to you know slow your aircraft down okay yep you should be expecting a lot of that because there are a lot of rogue aircrafts so i want me to make a tutorial for the phone just comment down below i'll do that okay so now you're on the runway okay you need to follow these uh you know arrows right here okay as i'm approaching these lines okay i just want to slow my aircraft down by just pushing b just lightly keep tapping b okay till your aircraft is at a complete stop and uh, now just like unset this click right here okay i'm just going to get few things cleared here e is for the engines a is to activate your you know controls s w and s is to you know adjust this i'm not going to do that cuz i don't want to take off right now once you're in the air you need to push g to you know get your landing gears up and then uh, u is to you know exit your aircraft l just keep pushing l and your lights will you know turn on okay and uh, then we have rudder rudder you see this thing on the back right here right here this helps you to you know turn your aircraft in a direction okay that or you can just you know just like turn it like this p is for push back we learned that already flaps is these things right here then we have the spoilers i'll get to that during the landing wheel brakes we got that this is also rudder and q is for smoke i believe this is for the um you know fighter jets okay and uh, also you can control you can also set your camera in uh, position i guess so one is for you know completely just you know moving around two is to you know just like a really realistic fov this is for the wings that's the gears this is the you know tail now to take off what you're going to do is since most of you if you're watching this video you guys are new so you're going to want to click right up here okay do not do do not click here click here okay and just click set now you can just click here and just turn it up to i'd say like 1400 or 2000 or some whatever you'd like okay just click set now, because most of you are not really that familiar with the controls you're going to you know, probably end up somehow crashing cuz hey it's okay i crashed like 50 times when i joined this game uh what you're going to do is just click this small toga button okay just click that and it will automatically fire up and uh yeah the autopilot will make sure that uh, your plane is currently just you know in a straight line and this will automatically pull up your aircraft but if you do not have that set you can press a and then like you know just you know pull your mouse up or something and there you go you're in the air okay and after some time you're going to press g okay just press g and yeah your aircraft wheels should be going up now if you are feeling a bit more comfortable with this you can just uncheck that okay and you can just you know freely fly around a bit okay and then uh, now we're going to do the landing part a quick tip when you are landing your speed is usually really high so this cannot be done in real aircraft thank god but in game what you can do is uh you can press r once and it, if you press it again it usually just goes up again okay but you can force it down okay and this stuff will happen now this will slow your aircraft down while that is happening um you're just going to push you know put your aircraft in at a particular speed on the autopilot and it's just going to maintain that for the landing 
Okay, now I'm just gonna deploy my gears. And look at that, they're down. Okay, this is usually the hardest part for people. What on PC you can just push, you can just push R once. So when your wheels touch down, a few like seconds later, just push R one more time, and that will like put your brakes to the max. And then you can also hold B if you're if you're too fast. So what you're gonna do is just you know stable out your aircraft, make sure it's really not moving. Use rudders if you're like off the center of the air. Yeah, that's gonna like make sure your volume's up because it tells you what's your height and stuff. And you're gonna gently just this is gonna gently go down. Yep, and just push the R, and that happens, and then just hold B, and there you go. Okay, if you you might find the landing part a bit hard for the first few times. But then trust me, it's really easy. And uh, if you all want me to teach you guys how to butter, okay, butter is the smoothest landing you can do on an aircraft. So if you all want me to teach you how to do that. Just comment down below, and there you go. Well, thank you guys for watching the episode one of How to Project Flight, and um, yeah, see you all in the next one. Like and sub.